Today on Keep It Home Up, I'm gonna show you how I installed this carbon monoxide alarm. These are the tools that I used. I used a Phillips screwdriver, a pencil, a hammer, the screw and the anchors that came with the carbon monoxide alarm, a 3 16th inch drill bit, and the carbon monoxide alarm itself. Not all alarms are gonna have this, but this one had a locking mechanism on it. So to get the locking mechanism off, I just took a razor blade and I cut two little plastic pieces that were holding it on there and that got it right off. Now this locking mechanism goes where the battery is. So it locks it so you can't pull the battery out until you really need to. For right now, we're gonna need to take it out. You'll see there's a little notch there on the side. You pull that towards you to open the alarm and get inside of it. Once inside, you pull the little plastic piece off the battery so you can activate it. And that little beep you heard is normal. It's supposed to be there. The battery needs to come out before you install it because there's a hole right there that one of the screws needs to go into. So now we're ready to install it on the ceiling. The first thing we need to do is mark where we're gonna drill the holes with the pencil. Now I should have marked it on the smaller end instead of the bigger end, but I checked it here at the last minute. I realized what I had done. So you'll see I'll scoot it over just a little bit there and make sure that the screws will fit just right if I drill the holes there. So then you grab a drill with a 3 16 inch bit and you drill the holes where your markings are. Uh, those other markings that you see on there, they're little holes from the old one. Then you put the anchors in and you'll need to tap those in with a hammer just a little bit just to make sure that they're flush with the ceiling. Next, we'll screw in the screws and you wanna make sure that they are away from the ceiling just a little bit, just like this, so that the carbon monoxide detector can slide in. You'll see right here when I put it on, Watch how it just kind of slides in, just like that. And then we'll tighten the screws the rest of the way, just a couple of turns to make sure that it's nice and tight on the ceiling. You don't want to do this too tight, just a quarter turn or so. Now what we're going to do is put the battery in with the plus on the plus side, negative on the negative side. We'll make sure that we put it in correctly. And then we close it up. I'm gonna put that battery lock in, and then we're gonna test it. You'll hear one beep, then four more. And then you'll hear four beeps again. Now you're ready to go. It has been installed. I hope this helped you. Please consider subscribing to my channel, and thank you so much for watching. <laughs>